Hi all, this is Carla at Carla's 001. So I'm hosting um, a mini page swap that's due January 31st. It's a 4x4 page swap and the theme is Valentine's Day. And this is my page in progress. Um, I'm using, um, so far I've used the Webster pages, it's like the Fuchsia um, blooms. Um, this is paper that's, I believe it's called, it's, it's banana leaf paper. It's really, really cool. See the natural texture it has? Um, and then I've hole punched um, a shrub in there. And this is actually a pocket, so I have to make tags to go in there, which is um, something I still have to do. And this, my dumb butt by accident put that one here and that one there so I'm gonna keep this one my, um, myself again this is not done yet um, but um, this is the one I'm gonna keep for myself just cuz I am not going to redo another one for that so I'm gonna somehow make it work for me um, so it says a hundred hearts would be too few to carry all my love for you and then it's got a frame and um, this is using some basil paper so I wanted this to be like red and brown red pink and brown so this is kind of my theme my scheme for this color and then this is okay I'm sorry this is the first page and then this is the back so you would put the hole punches here somewhere and this is a trim that I bought at the expo which I absolutely love um, it's I think it's like three inches, four inches. Sorry, four inches. It's um it's four inches. Um and this is the cover. So again, I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Um, but I believe I'm gonna add some more flowers here. Um, I just absolutely loved it when I saw it. I knew I wanted it for this swap. And this is a pocket in here. So um again, this is the back. I have to make some tags and this is the front so yeah it's very simple um, but it's still in progress I will have a video up within the next month probably right after the holidays with the finished um, the finished mini page but I am I believe I'm in in group three there's three groups and each group has seven so I think I'm in group three. I would I should probably know this since I am the one hosting, but I really I can't remember. I know these are some of the um I bought some gosh, something bowling. I can't remember the name. And they're like vintage uh Valentine's Day tickets. And then I'm gonna be using these. They're like these vintage buttons. So I'm gonna be using these as well. Um and then I wanted to show you guys a quick um haul. I just ordered these. Um, I have a few coming. There's there was four that came out. Unity stamps came out with these stamps made just for Webster pages, um, and they go with their paper collection, their their holiday paper collection. You guys see how beautiful that is. The dress form says Happy Holiday, Smile, Joy, Love, Happy, um, and then that says Handmade with Love. So this is very generic. You can use any time. It's not really holiday-ish looking, but the dress form, and I love, love dress forms. And then this one has a balloon, a hot air balloon, and in here, I believe that's supposed to be Santa with Christmas gifts. And then in the middle stamp, it says Merry Christmas, and that one... Um, just as airmail Christmas wish list and these are really uh, um, Unity stamps are my favorite favorite stamps to buy Hi. Hi. you know I just bought a tripod which I absolutely love and I thought oh let me do this quick video it's just I don't need I don't need to connect my camera to my tripod. Sorry. So look at the size of the stamp. It's a big stamp. I mean the um you know these stamps are 
a lot of people would say they're a little pricey. I mean, this these sets do go for twenty dollars, and the large sets go for forty five, fifty dollars. But they are absolutely my favorite. They to me have the best detail stamps ever. So this is the last one. This is the hot air balloon. Again, I have. I just got wet. It's. Uh, I have a really big hand. I'm 5'10", so I have big hands. You just... And this one. But again, this one's my favorite. And then I just bought this by Quick Cuts. I absolutely love that. You don't have to put on the skirt, but I love it. Um, and I was looking for this dress from I purchased. It's an embossing folder at the expo that I can't find but as soon as I I haven't seen anybody with it it was absolutely gorgeous they were sold out I ordered it I received it in the mail just a few days ago and I can't find it so as soon as I find it I'm gonna put out another haul video I'm home I had surgery last week I'm doing good so I've been doing lots and lots of retail therapy so there's going to be tons tons of haul videos coming in this week yeah, I have like, I, I don't know, I have, I've placed like six online orders, Joann's, Hobby Lobby, I Am Roses, Wild Orchids, um, Unity Stamps, Sizzix.com, I'm just, I, I, I'm feeling better now. <laughs> okay, you guys, so um, again, this is really the reason that I did this page, and um, I'm really honest. I'm going to be really, really honest. I'm not really happy with it. I have one of my really good evil scrappers. Um, I, after I saw her page, Ty, hi, Ty. Um, Ty, make sure you leave a comment below so um, they know who you are. Ty is really new to YouTube. After I saw Ty's mini page, I was so blown away. I'm like, okay, mine looks really crappy. Hers is so beautiful, I'm just not liking mine at all. I was happy with it, but now I think I'm like, this is so plain. So again, this is what I have so far. I'm thinking I'm going to make this into a flip-out book. That's what I'm thinking I'm going to do so it kind of pops out. I'm going to put Velcro here. And I'm going to make some gorgeous... The only thing I can think of is to make some really, really cute tags. Um, and then do something with this page, obviously. Again, this is in progress. This is not done. But please let me know what you think I should add. Comments, um, I would really, really appreciate it. Thank you guys. Hugs to you all. And I hope you all had wonderful Thanksgiving. And have a beautiful, amazing, happy and safe holidays. Bye.